Assalamu alaikum audience welcome to my channel in today's session we will discuss about anthrax a biological weapon used in biological warfare so what is the biological warfare biological warfare is the war based on use of biological agents particularly microorganisms such as bacteria viruses fungi and their toxins and spores to kill humans animals and plants through highly infectious diseases among the bacteria anthrax is considered as the most important biological agent used in biological warfare due to its persistence for long period and its spores which are highly tough and difficult to destroy even survive at very high temperature discovery of bacteria before further discussion on anthrax first have a brief overview about discovery of bacteria so bacteria were first discovered by anton van leeuwenhoek as animal cules in 60s Further, Louis Pasteur developed germ theory of disease and germ theory of fermentation, in which he discovered role of microorganisms in causing disease and production of alcohol. No doubt, most of the microorganisms are our friends and play a great role in our daily life, recycling materials through decomposition. and help in digestion as probiotics however few of them are highly dangerous and cause serious infections in living organisms so coming to the major topic anthrax what is anthrax anthrax also called as malignant pustule or wool sorters disease is a very serious disease of humans and animals It is caused by spore forming gram positive bacterium named as Bacillus anthracis. Characteristics of bacterium Bacillus anthracis. Bacillus anthracis is a aerobic in nature, spore forming encapsulated gram positive in nature, non motile rod shape belongs to the class of bacilli under bacillus e family and bacillus genus discovery of bacillus anthracis bacillus anthracis was discovered by a german physician robert koch in 1876 experimentally proves as pathogen through experimental steps called as koch's postulates developed by him first proof of germ theory of disease that microorganisms cause disease anthrax bacilli are commonly found in soils and the most infective in grazing animals such as cattle sheep goats horses and mules it is transmitted to humans by eating meat handling wool hair hides are dead bodies of anthrax affected animals anthrax disease consists of three forms such as cutaneous anthrax pulmonary anthrax and gastrointestinal anthrax cutaneous anthrax in this form of the anthrax a small necrotic lien or papule will develop on face neck arms or hands after 2 to 3 days of infection slowly papule produces rings of vesicles and rise to form a clear black scar cutaneous anthrax is the most common form of anthrax which occurs 90% in humans 
producing black lien on skin. It occurs when anthrax spores get into the skin through cut during handling infected animals or contaminated products. Pulmonary anthrax, also called as inhaling anthrax, is known as the most deadly form of anthrax. In this form, anthrax spores are inhaled during processing of hair and wool of animals and results in shortness of breath, cough, chest discomfort, fever and chills, extreme tiredness and body edges. Gastrointestinal anthrax This form of anthrax occurs due to eating raw or uncooked beef of the anthrax infected animals. Anthrax spores affect the upper gastrointestinal tract, stomach and intestines with wide variety of symptoms such as painful swallowing, hoarseness, stomach pain, bloody diarrhea, swelling of abdomen, nausea and bloody vomiting, and inflammation of intestinal tract. Anthrax is a biological weapon. Anthrax is the greatest risk to be used as biological warfare and bioterrorism agent. Anthrax was first used as a biological warfare agent in early 90s in World War I. In 2001, anthrax bioterrorism incidents happened in USA in the form of powder in letters mailing system and infected many people including deaths. Anthrax in the form of powder or liquid may be used in number of types of weapons such as missiles, bombers, artillery, mortars and aircraft. Due to biological warfare, expire of anthrax spores in air will result in breathing of spores and causing anthrax. Inhalation or pulmonary anthrax is the most serious form of anthrax and quickly kill people if not treated properly. Anthrax treatment and prevention. Specific antibiotics such as ciprofloxacin and doxycycline can be used to treat anthrax infections. Moreover, vaccine is available to prevent anthrax. However, anthrax vaccine is only recommended for certain groups at risk such as military personnel and health workers or those people who are at the areas with outbreaks of anthrax disease.